Hello everyone. Today I will be showing you how to install best dictionaries into your iOS devices. It can be iPhone or iPad. These dictionaries are not for Android users, only for iOS. So to install these dictionaries, first you need to make sure that your phone is jailbroken and to know that your phone is jailbroken you look you have to look at your home screen to find an app or an icon called Cedia and the icon look brown it looks like a package in the middle like this one so if you, you cannot find on the home screen there is another way to see if your phone is jailbroken and has CD installed. You scroll down like this, type in CD. And you see in my phone, the CD is at the top. I can see it. So, which means my phone is jailbroken. So, once your phone is jailbroken, you need to go to CD to install a package called AppSync. So why do we need to install AppSync? Because all the dictionaries that I show you here is not free dictionary. If you go to App Store, those dictionary are, are not free. They have you have to pay at least twenty dollars per dictionary. But there is a way to install those dictionaries for free. All you have to do is you have to go to CDN. <coughs> and first, for some people who has their phone jailbroken in a phone shop, it's usually phone shop they install AppSync for you already. But some phone shop they have not installed yet. So to see if the AppSync has already installed or not in your phone, you have to click. Look at the bottom here. Have CD sources changes installed and search. You click install to see if your phone has installed AppSync or not. In my case, I have already installed it. It can be just AppSync or can be AppSync Unify like this. So because I already installed it for you. Just take a look at it. it. Can be AppSync or AppSync Unify. If you have it, you're good to go. If you don't have it, you have to install it. You go to search, type in App Sync, and you see we have lots of choices, lots of App Syncs for different version of iOS. So you have to check. Your iOS version. To check your iOS version, you have to go back, go to settings, you have to go to general, about, and look at the version. So my phone is version 9.0.1, so which means I am running iOS 9. So, the best is this one. It's AppSync from iOS 5 to iOS 9. This is the best one. The other is not for iOS 9, so you cannot install it. It's not compatible. So, um, to get this AppSync, you need to also install a source because if you don't install a source you don't have the app sync so install a source you have to go to sources you have to click edit and then click add and then you have to type in repo dot hack 
your iPhone dot org and then you click add source I will also include this address in the link in the description below so I already add a source here is the source so you don't have to go through the source you just have to install the source you just go to search type in app sync and you can see it's here so you have to click on it and click install confirm and that's done after you install it you have to go back to home screen for example I delete this one so for example if I don't have dictionary now I want to install it you are asking already now you need to find the file for dictionary how do you install it where where are the files so the file I have put in the link in put the links in the descriptions you can click all of the links or one of the link you can download all of the dictionaries because all of those are the best or download any other dictionary that you like but I would recommend you download all of them and install all of them into your phone if you are English language learner you want to use all the best dictionary those are the best so now you need to click like I said one of the links in the description once you click one link any link after you click you will see this page it, it's black for example I click Chambers Thesaurus dictionary when you click to install it look at the arrow here the down arrow and you say download you click it it will automatically download and save into your computer once the download is done here you need to install it to install you need to plug in your phone into a computer using a cable after you plug in you need to make sure that you have software to install the dictionary there is software that's there are two softwares that you can use they are free one software is called iTools this one or iFunbox it's up to you if you like iFunbox use iFunbox if you like iTools you use iTools but for me I use iFunbox it's much simpler it's easier to use so if you don't have iFunbox I also include the link to the website of iFunbox to download and install it in the description below you can find so once you have iFunbox click on it you will see this which means your phone is plugged in you have to click to install the app you have to click install app here okay and then you try to find the app that you have at the moment so this is the dictionary the dictionary that I have downloaded now you click open to install it you can see in your phone there's a new dictionary installed the chambers the thesaurus now you're done you can try to use it it works looks fine you can type anything this is what we call um, synonym antonym dictionary 
So if in case you want to find the synonym of the words to use in your writing or something here, they have lots of synonyms. This is a very useful dictionary. So that's it, John. That's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.